hi in the given problem the expression for magnetic flux linked through a coil is given as 2.00 e raised to the power minus 3 t into sine of 120 pi t this is the expression for the magnetic flux linked through the coil so expression for emf induced using faraday's laws of electromagnetic induction will be given by time derivative of this magnetic flux which is itself as a function of time so here it will become the der derivative of this function which is the product of two variables so to differentiate it you will have to apply the product rule in which first of all we consider this e raised to the power minus 3t as a constant and we will differentiate sine of 125t and then we will consider this sine 125t as a constant and we will differentiate e raised to the power minus 3t in whole of this process 2.00 will remain as constant common so now first of all we consider this e raised to the power minus 3t as a constant and the differentiation of this sign will be cos sign cos 125 t after that the differentiation of this substitute which is 125 t its differentiation with respect to time will come out to be 120 into pi plus now we have to consider this sign 125 t as a constant so this is sine 125 t being used as a constant so differentiation of e differentiation of e raised to the power minus 3t will be as it is and then differentiation of this power minus 3t will be minus 3 only so now if we rearrange these terms e raised to the power minus 3t can be taken as a common out so it will become 2.00 into e raised to the power minus 3 t bracket 100 pi into cos 120 pi t and then minus 3 sine 120 pi t again so this is the expression for the emf induced now we have to find the value of current passing through the coil at various times and for this the resistance of the coil has been given as 5.00 ohm so in the first part of the problem we have to find the current induced at a time of zero seconds so first of all we will obtain an expression for the current using ohm's law this will be given as epsilon by r so here it becomes 2.00 e raised to the power minus 3t divided by 5 120 pi cos 120 pi t minus 3 sine 125t so when the time is zero the value of current will come out to be here 2 by 5 becomes 0 0.4 e raised to the power minus 0 as the time is 0 then 120 pi cos 0 if we put the time 0 and then minus 3 sine 0 and we know sine 0 is 0 while cos 0 is 1 so we get here this is 0 0.4 for e raised to the power minus 0 this is 1 this is 120 pi into 1 ampere this is the current the value of current so when we calculate all these values the current at a time 0 comes out to be minus one fifty point seven milli ampere. 
this is the value of current in the first case and as this magnetic field is upward and it is increasing with the time so as a reason for the emf induced is outward increasing magnetic flux outward increasing magnetic flux so its opposition will be as per lenz's law inward increasing magnetic flux and we know magnetic field enters only into the south pole so the direction of current in the coil will be clockwise now in the second part of the problem the time has been given as 2.17 into 10 dash to power minus 2 second so now the value of this current will come out to be if you put the value of this time here in this expression the expression used will be the same in the same expression when we put the value of time then the current the value of this current will come out to be minus 139 milliampere and as the direction as the sign of the current is again negative so the direction still will be clockwise then finally in the third part of the problem when the time is given as three second now putting the value of this time as three second in the first equation again the value of current will come out to be minus 0 0.116 milliampere again it is having a negative sign so again the direction of the current induced will be clockwise thank you